being Halloween ready means prepping for a party, we have some tricks that can turn into tasty treats. We're learning how to make charcuterie boards with a holiday spin. Halloween's almost here, but it's not just costumes and decor that can get you into the spooky spirit. Columbus Craft Meats charcuterie director, Evan Inada, is teaching us how to make the perfect spreads for the season. So it all starts with that meat and cheese combination. Salami is that bridge that brings all the different flavors on the charcuterie board together. There are lots of different types of salami. Depending on your palate, you can go for mild, spicy, or even sweet. Evan recommends choosing around two to three types and about two ounces per person. The leftovers you go is build a sandwich or have snacks afterwards. Then a hard Italian cheese works well with most meats, but you can also add in fresh and creamy options for variety. And to help with the next part of our board, getting creative. On this board right here, we did a little bit of scream, little scary movie flare on this, so using the brie to make a scream mask. Then add some darker jam into the holes of your scream mask to make it complete. Same thing with here. I'm personally a big fan of Jason, so having that Jason mask along with some spooky characters and fun flavors are just always a great option to just bring the whole crowd into a Halloween theme party, especially. And with this board, Evan used a circular brie to shape the mask. And then using some a little bit of salami on our Columbus salami as the accents of red because it has that nice dark red crimson color as well as using dried fruits so dried blueberries and figs as those little markings to really make that Jason mask pop. And use a small cookie cutter to make some cheesy ghosts without much effort. And the only thing left to round out your board is the extras. I always make sure you'd be conscious of the textures that you're bringing on a board so choosing fruits that have that nice acidity to really elevate the meat and the salami that we're making, as well as really having that crunch. Crackers can provide the perfect crunch, and brightly colored fruits can make a board pop. The most important part is to taste good, as well as looks as good as it does. Spooky charcuterie, that's perfect for Halloween.